How long? Hmm? How long has this been going on? I, I don't remember. You don't remember when you started cutting yourself? I, I can't think right now. Please don't let me think. Okay. I just... I can't help you if you don't tell me. Then don't help me. But... But I, I want to. I'm... I'm your cousin. <laughs> you don't have to do anything. Kinship doesn't come with a manual that says, help your blood relative every time you see them cutting themselves. But... But it's the right thing to do. I mean... It's common sense. It's it's called being a decent human being. You you help those in need. I don't need help from anyone. That's why I do the things that I do to myself. I help myself. Self-harm isn't helping yourself. It isn't helping the situation you're stuck in. It isn't helping your mental and physical health. It, it doesn't help if the active is called self-harm, Candace. You don't know the first thing about this, Alan. You don't. I, I find salvation in this. It helps me relieve myself of all the negative energy, of all this stress and, and exhaustion in my life. It just, it's like a big sigh of relief for me. Like the burden of living just washes away with every drop of blood that runs down my hand. This heals me. And you will never understand. That is just ironic, Candace. So ironic. And you fail to see that what you're doing to yourself isn't going to airlift you out of the dumps or, or make you feel better about yourself because it just, it just never will. Okay? Two negatives don't make a positive in the real world. These scars are never going to go away. That's the thing. It's a part of me now. It's never going to go away. It's my story. It may be a part of your story, but it's a dark part of your story. These scars weren't earned. They were made. They were made by the negativity you are currently living through. And this is why you need to tell me. You need to talk to me so I can help Stop you. Please, me. please. Please, Candace, you open up to me. To I'm anything. desperate. I want to help I can't you. Hear I need you. to know why Stop you've been doing this. Why it happened. Please. I'm Alan, afraid you're going to do something even you. more dangerous. Alan, I need I'm to so know. I'm afraid I'm going to lose you forever. <laughs> talking isn't going to bring it back. Talking isn't going to bring Jason back. It's not. He was only seven. He didn't deserve to die so young. You're right, he didn't deserve to die. So, why did it have to happen to him? Hmm? I don't know. Maybe. Wrong place, wrong time, I guess. And the fucker who did it just drove off and got away with it. But, but maybe everything happens for a reason. Don't tell me that bullshit, Alan. You think that there's some god out there that decided Jason should just die so that something positive can happen to me or those that knew him? <sighs> Look at me, Alan. You think that Jason being hit by a car happened so that something good can come out of my life? My mom's? My dad's? Our entire fucking family? Fuck your everything happens for a reason bullshit. That's not life. That's an outlook. Your outlook. That's just wishful thinking. The truth of the matter is that Jason is gone. If there are no more sunshine 
and daisies in my life anymore. There just isn't. It doesn't have to be like this. What you're doing to yourself, that isn't honoring his life. And I hate to be blunt about this, but what you're doing, you're just shitting on his life right now. You should be out living the rest of your days in honor of him, in happiness, rejoicing in all the good that he has brought to everyone's lives, your mom, your dad, your family, me, you. Just living your life the way you should be, embracing all the good that the world has to offer. Instead, you sit in the bathroom on the floor, bleeding out all of the goodness in you. You can be so much more. You can have all the sunshine and daisies you want. You just have to reach out for it. You just have to be the sunshine and daisies. Do it for Jason. Do it for yourself. I believe in you. I believe in you so much. You're right. And I'm sorry I said that everything happens for a reason. It's, it's too It does work in some situations. Just not all. Are you gonna be okay? Yeah. I think. I think I'll be alright. Okay. Thank you, Alan, for everything. <sighs> Thank you for being strong. I believe in you, Candace. Physical. <laughs> fuck you, Candace. I'm just kidding. No, 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 no. Fuck you, Candace. I'm sorry. Fuck you, Alan. <laughs> what? Hurry up and say your line. <laughs> stay in character. <laughs> they may be a part of your story. But it's But it's a dark part of your story.